Hello and welcome! I'm Norvigicus and this is my let's play of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. So, uh, as soon as I logged into the game, it told me that now Season Pass was unlocked. And when I looked at the map here, there was a golden ULC chest on the map, which weren't there before, I'm pretty sure. Um, I have no idea what it is, but I'm pretty sure it's kind of like the, um, some extra stuff, um, probably. But, let's look at the, uh, summer screen for Havana right here. So we have two more viewpoints, we have three more assassin contracts, we have six more chests, one more shanty, uh, four more fragments, and three more secrets to find in Havana itself. Let's just start with the ULC chest. Pretty sure the ULC chest does not count for the chest total, but that is fine. Um, what is in it? It is Ivory Wheel. Oh, right. So it's just some extra stuff for the ship that we don't have yet. Yeah. So... While I'm picking up these things, uh, let me tell you a story from when I first played this game back in 2013. I was very, very excited for this game to come out. Um, I didn't know how good it was going to be until I got it, obviously, but yeah, I loved it. And um, what ended up happening was that I, instead of waiting for it to come out in Norway, I was a little bit dumb and I actually... Um, got it from the US. I ordered it from the US instead. And the reason why that was a dumb idea is because of um, region, like region locking. So when I got it, it wasn't uh, from uh, for Europe or European PlayStation. So I couldn't actually get everything in the game because some of it was locked behind like US. Um, like, you have to be in the, U in the US, or you have to, like, have your PlayStation registered in the US or whatever to get some of the stuff, some of the uh, DLC stuff. So I wasn't actually able to get that, which was very annoying. Um, so that meant I couldn't fully upgrade my ship, because to do that, you had to get the last DLC stuff and stuff like that. So I, I did miss out on a few things because of that. I didn't know that at the time, of course, when I ordered it, but... I was very salty <laughs> at the time because I really wanted to just um, do everything, but I couldn't. I did everything I could except for that. Uh, there was a few. There were a few upgrades I couldn't do. I guess a few upgradable items that I couldn't get and stuff like that. But now that I have it on Steam, I'm pretty sure everything is available. Um, when I bought the game on Steam, I got every DLC and everything at the same time, so I'm pretty sure that I have everything I want from this game this time. And there might even be some, um, some quests in this game that I have never done before because of that. Okay, so I only got one more chest. Wait, was that chest even there before doing this? Not sure, but at least we got a new viewpoint, and there's a chest down there in this restricted area. I don't think we've been there before, have we? Not really sure. Let's go there and get the chest anyway. Move away, people. I'm running here. I'm walking here. Oh, oh, this this place has uh, a bell and stuff. That means it's probably a plantation or something like that. It's kind of an asshole move to put a chest in there, huh? So I don't want to fight all these guys, especially since there are two brutes over there. And they are scary. I could just uh, do this though, I guess. Just run away again. Nobody expects me to have killed them, right? Right? And there are two more brutes over here. I can do this. No, they're, they're just regular guys. Oh well, let's kill them the same way. Go, double kill, and then... Oh, he saw me. Fuck. Someone is gonna ring the bell now and uh, they're gonna get reinforcements, which is not good. Yeah. Now there's gonna be a lot of guys coming for me. I don't mind. Let's just kill them. There's one guy for the moment, or at the moment. Let's kill the guy with a bell. Can you stop ringing the bell, please? There we go. Just kick him in the face. And the... oh! That's a, uh, sniper. Can you come down here, please? Guess he doesn't bother. 
I could shoot him, but that will attract people as well. Just wait for him to turn around. Could you please turn around? Thank you. Alright. Get the chest. It's probably just money. Yeah. But money is very good for me for when I get the ship. Because upgrades are, as I said, pretty um, expensive. I'm pretty sure they cost money. As well as other resources like wood and metal. And is there one more thing? Maybe at least wood and metal. Which you get from other ships. Which is part of the game. Uh, very fun to go around and sinking ships to get stuff. Uh, let's just save these pirates, why not? Oh, there's one pirate. Can you please climb up here, Edward? Before the pirate dies. Kill the agile dude. And then that dude. Come on, it's easier to just wait for him to kill or attack me so I can just counter him. There you go, dude. Grazie. My thanks. I'm your man now, Capitano. Nice. Alright, that was one more pirate for the ship that I don't have. <laughs> At least not yet. Let's get the manuscript. Let's kill these two losers. And there's another loser right here. And a third loser right here, who's trying to get me while I'm attacking these other dudes. But that didn't work, did it? Alright. Two more manuscripts to get. Uh, do I have them on a map, even? I do not? Well, it's kind of hard to know, because they could be regular chests. No, wait. That's the manuscript, right. Yes, yeah, so I have one up there. There's probably one more up there, because I haven't um, synchronized that viewpoint yet. Let's get this chest. Oh, collect five manuscript pages, okay. I can't remember what these Abstergo challenges are even for, um, but I'm guessing you get some kind of bonus, maybe, from Ubisoft. Um, I don't know. They're probably for something. I don't really care about them all that much. The game doesn't tell you what challenges, what the challenges are until you've done them. There's probably a screen that tells you. Where's this chest? Is it down there? It's down there. Yeah, it's down there. Okay. Get down there. And there we go. That's the chest. Boom. Very close to finishing off the chests in the Havana area. Uh, is there anything to do in the taverns? I don't think there is. Go check. I think the taverns are useful later on, but... Right now, I don't think I can do much with the taverns. Um, can get crew there, it said. Gather intel and play games. So, probably some kind of mini games. Hello, Mr. Cat. Yeah. I don't know what I can do now, though. Probably nothing much. Right, I can see. I can go see. Oh. Alright. Uh, okay, so I can get information, or I can drink, <laughs> and I can play games. Is, is that Yahtzee? It's probably not Yahtzee, right? Steel? No, that's not what I want. Oh, right. Play. What do I play here? Checkers? Eh. I don't feel- I'm not feeling it. It's just, you know, a mini game you can do for fun. Um, yeah, so let's, um not do this north northern area for now. I want to go for the assassin contract that is right there first and then go for the main mission. This might be the main mission that I'm thinking about that we have to sneak at night. The last um, mission before we get a ship, I think. Yeah. My memory is kind of blurry when it comes to the, um, the missions in this game because I haven't played it in a while. But I do remember that quest being kind of annoying, because you have to avoid combat, I think. So you have to be sneaky. And there are a lot of guards there, so I might fail that quest a few times, because uh, it's, it's not very easy to do. Let's hope this um, assassin contract is a little bit easier, though. Um, okay. Unlicensed dealer. Antonio Rueda, a Templar associate, is trading weapons and explosives uh, in Havana's trade district. Find him and his business and his life. 
all right and I have to stay out of combat as usual which is what is usually the thing with these contracts it's fine where is he right there okay it's not too far away from me I suppose and it's not too far away from the main mission either that's a little bit off the road but that's fine I can deal with it oh didn't mean to go to the ladder there but I did anyway all right uh, come on, Edward. Now you're just being silly. Stop being silly. Just do what I tell ya. You're my slave, Edward. Kind of. <laughs> oh, pirates. Should I save them? I guess why not. Kill these dudes. There's a lot of dudes. Oh, what are you doing, Edward? Oh, one of the pirates is almost dead. Oh. Which one is it? They kill one pirate already. I get I got him. Pull me from the deep there, Captain. Yeah. Jack thanks your hardy. That was very close for one of them. These pirates are very bad, but I mean they're also like fighting so many people alone. Okay. So we have a lot of dudes here. Four of them here. I can't get past them without being spotted. I do have a few dancers around here, though, that I could use to distract these guards. There are probably people on the roof. Uh, there is definitely a sniper somewhere around here, and there is also two dudes over there. They'll see me if I climb up here, I think. Hmm. Okay. This one is slightly harder than the ones I've done already. So they won't see me if I do this. But... Hmm. What if I climb up... No, no, no. What if I climb up here? I want to, I want you to climb up there. Can you do that for me? No, nope. can't do that. Alright. There's a ladder here, but is that safe? Because there could be a dude right up here. Oh. Almost saw me. Down there, wow. You have a keen eye, sir. Can I go for the ladder? I can. Oh, okay, so that's the sniper. Let's take him out. He's kind of important to kill. He never turns around, does he? There's a dude over there as well. I don't think he can see me from here, so that's fine. Okay, so now you're dead. Just loot him for fun. Bullets are full. Okay, so where is my target? Is right there. Oh, that means I can just jump on him, probably. If he ever moves. Because I don't think I'm close enough to kill him right now. Oh! There's a dude right there. I didn't see him. Let's kill him. not see that dude. I can jump on that dude, but I don't care about him. Why can I jump on him? He's even too far away. Still. Okay, so there is... I do see another dude, but he's on the roof over there, so I don't think he's gonna be a problem. Can I kill him now, though? Is he being highlighted? I think he's being highlighted. Let's kill him. There we go! I got him. I'm still not in combat. Nice. That was a very clean, clean kill, actually. The unlicensed dealer contract is completed. All oh, right, you're you're still here. Oh, you're gonna shoot me. Yeah, it didn't work. What? Tap me. Yeah. No one else is gonna help you. Nice. There we go. Wait, what did you say? New customization something something? Oh, went away. I just saw it as soon as I clicked the um, the map button, but okay. Uh, that looks like the last Assassin's Contract on this side of the map. There is one more over here. And I think there are two more in the game, or in the, um, in the uh, Havana area, right? Yes, two more. So there's probably one more up north. 
Anyway, let's go for the main mission. A man they call the Sage. Yes, I was supposed to meet the Templar guy um, by the docks, I think he said. In the previous main mission. So that's probably what I'm gonna do. Meet the old man, the old Templar man. Duncan, over here. Oh, that's um, Rogers. Yeah, Rogers was a famous pirate hunter in real life, actually. Good morning, Duncan. Just over here. Edward! Hello, Edward! I found a man to purchase my remaining sugar! Huh? Quite a coup, I must say! He just called you Edward. Oh, that's the merchant who sailed me here. Out of caution, I gave him a false name. Ah, well done. We'll catch up on it later. Very punctual, Duncan. This way. Here he is. A man both Templars and Assassins have sought for over a decade. I am told your surname is Roberts. Is this so? You recognize this, I think. According to old tales, the blood of a sage is required to enter the observatory. We have the key. Now we need only its location. Perhaps Mr. Roberts will be eager to provide it. Transfer him to my residence. Wow. Any... No. Just follow him, okay. Such a fuss over one man. Is the observatory really such a grand prize? See, si. see si him do that. The observatory was a tool built by the Precursor race. Its worth is without measure. Precursor race? I see. One of your early letters mentioned a desire to kill the Mayan mentor, Atabai. Were you able to carry out this contract before coming here? I... I was not, no. Too many complications along the way. A pity. But the maps you delivered with the blood vial will see that job finished. Aye. That's the idea. Okay. I don't like this route, Torres. We're exposed. Something is wrong. Stay close, Grandmaster. I feel it too. Do not let them get their hands on the sage, at whatever cost. Oh. Assassin! Use the pistols in combat. Above! They're on the rooftop! Shoot him. Nope. I used it. <laughs> oh. Wait. Oh, no, no, no. Try to shoot me over there. Did I use a human shield? Let me get him. Yes, I'm supposed to kill assassins now. Because I'm not officially assassin yet. They're trying to kill me. Oh no, they're just shooting other people, I guess. Not me, necessarily. Come on, get up there. Get him. They're probably very confused as to why a person dressed in assassin's clothes are killing them right now. There we go. Oh, Torres is almost dead. He's the guy I'm supposed to, um save or defend what are you doing that word for fuck's sake come on i'm not trying to do that I'm trying to get back to down there where he is uh there we go remain near allies i'm trying my best why are we going backwards oh Come on. Go. Huh? <laughs> Alright. Stay close to Torres. Don't you try. Don't you dare. Torres lost more than half his health already, so. Come on. They're just agile dudes in assassin's clothes. Easy enough. Oh. Wow. <laughs> this is badass. 
Stop it! Oh. Tackle the sage from above. How do I do that? You're a nimble one, I'll give you that. How do I tackle him from above? Do I jump on him from above? No, oh, this is gonna be this is not gonna be fun, is it? Come on, climb up, for fuck's sake. This, this is not gonna be fun. Both of us, mate. Can I even do that? Oh, he's, he's running on the on the ground now. I think I can do that actually. Stop, or I'll kneecap you! I'll kneecap you? Maybe I can catch him right here. Did that count? I'm not sure if it counted. Well done, lapdog. Quiet. We'll see him to the prisons, Grandmaster. Double the watch. Well, I'll be buggered. What an active day we've had, gents. See, he's set on all sides by our enemies. We must be more cautious. I do wish I could remain to see our drama done, but I must avail myself of these winds and sail for England. By all means, Captain, speed and fortune to you. With luck, I'll return myself a governor. And with my idiot king's blessing, no less. Adios. As for you, Mr. Walpole, I consider this the first payment in a long-term investment. Gracias. Obliged. I would like you to be present for the interrogation tomorrow. Call around noon. Yes, sir. See if it counted. No, it didn't count. Seriously, <laughs> I. What else am I supposed to do? I jumped at him from above. Isn't that like tackling? I guess not. All right, let's try this again. Um, maybe it's because I used the um, the attack button instead of the the uh, tackle button this last time. I didn't know there was a really a difference, but I guess there is. <laughs> One hour later. Well okay, I done. got him this time after failing this like we'll see him to the it feels like 15 times, but I guess it wasn't Double that much. The, the game just did not want me to succeed in this apparently, but I got in the end anyway. I tackled the sage from above and got 100% synchronization. Awesome. So we still have all the missions we've done 100% synchronized. Good on me. Um, okay, so we're right here. That's actually a pretty good spot to be in because there are some stuff we can collect here. What is the next mission? It's down there. In that case, let's get some more stuff instead because we still have a few more things that we can uh, collect around here. Looks like this chest is up here. I will do... Maybe I'll do the rest of the Assassin's Contract because I haven't been playing for long. Um, so I might as well, right? Oh, looks like we do just looking for this or looking at this chest. I really care about you. Uh, some pirates here don't really care about them. Let's get the fragment over here instead. Let's kill this dude because he's annoying. Yeah. Die. All right. Where is this fragment? Right over here. Maybe I'll do another main mission instead. I don't know what to do yet. I, I this mission was very very short. Um. So, I don't know. How do I get this one? Do I have to climb in here, maybe? Let's just jump. Whee! Take some damage, it's fine. Uh, another fragment over here. Is it up there? They're, pro they're usually up in the air, those fragments. They're, sh they're rarely down on the ground, right? Uh, okay, it's right there. Just have to climb that wall or wherever that is. Can I climb down there? I can. Okay. Let's climb back up because it looks like there are some other things up there. Like a chest, for example. What is this even? This is a building of some kind. Like, obviously it's a building, but what kind of building? Wait. Oh. Okay. It looks like the chest is on the, on the other side here. And there's a fragment up there. Okay. Yeah, this is probably a cathedral, maybe? Wait, where's the chest? It's down there. 
Come on. Come on. Get down there. There we go. Good boy, Edward. Let's get the chest. Is that the last one? No, it's just one more left after this one. And let's get the fragment up there. Come on. There we go. Up on top of the cross. On the very top of the cathedral. I'm assuming it's a cath cathedral since it's so big. It's probably not just a church. There we go. And... Let's get the treasure map too. Why not? Let's just work our way towards the uh, north side of the map. Why don't we? Looks like I can just jump down here. Leap of faith. It'll probably kill a regular man, but since he's an assassin, he survived. Wait. Uh, get the treasure map. Uh, it's up there. Okay. Okay. Mr. Treasure Map, I can get you. This probably counts as a secret too, right? Oh. It's a dead body in the bushes that nobody cares about, even though it's very visible. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's get the last shanty. Why don't we? It's uh, on top of the roof right there. Let's not fail it. It's the last shanty of Havana. Oh, it's already flying away. Come on. I was too close to it. Come on. Don't be bashful, Mr. Shanty. Come on, get it. There we go. That's the last shanty of Havana. Great. We don't have to worry about those until we get to the next area that has shanties. I don't think every area has shanties, but a lot of them do. Especially the bigger settlements, obviously, but, you know, any regular island you find won't necessarily have shanties, I think. Uh, where is this manuscript? Oh. I see the dude. And they see me. Yep, whatever. Let's just kill you. Not very scared of you guys. You're just regular guys anyway. What? Attack me. Attack me. Oh, this random lady is helping me too. Thank you. But you don't have to worry about me. These guys are easy to kill. Oh, looks like an, an agile guy is joining us. Well, your mistake. Okay, so that is the last um the last secret of Havana. Nice. Getting close to the end here now of Havana. Let's get this last chest as well, and I think that might be the last fragment, isn't it? Let me see. Uh, yeah, one more fragment too. And it's over there. Wait, is the fragment? Ah, oh, it's closer. The fragment is closer, so let's get that first. It's uh, up there, okay. On top of another cross. So this is probably a church, since it is a little bit smaller than the other building we were on. Could be a large church though, the other one. I don't know. I live in a in a country where cathedrals are kind of non-existent. <laughs> um, there aren't many cathedrals in Norway, um, so I don't really know the difference between a cathedral or a church, other than the, the cathedrals are usually bigger. <laughs> there are probably some other differences too, but I don't know. Let's get up here and get this viewpoint. I think this is the last viewpoint of Havana, isn't it? Let's go. Yes. Beautiful view of Havana. There we go. Was that the last one? That was the last one indeed. So we need two more contracts and one more chest. The chest is right here, The con and one of the contracts I guess you have to complete five contracts to unlock the last one, or maybe they are in succession or something, I don't know. But there's only one on the map as of right now. Maybe the last one will, will um, show up when I got when I uh, do this one. Only one way to find out? Where's the chest? Oh, it's right there, I didn't see it. <laughs> it was blending in so well. Come on. There we go, loot it. There we go, all the chests in Havana. And let's go for the contract. It's down there, apparently. Oh, 
come on. You don't see me anymore. There we go. Let's see what this contract is all about. No more taxes. A corrupted officer is stealing from merchants in Havana's rich, rich district and is using the money to fund Templar operations elsewhere. Didn't tell me to kill him though, but I'm assuming that's what I'm supposed to do. Because that is usually how it is. And that shadow is very creepy right there. Oh, it's very close actually. Okay, let's uh, go get that guy. Oh, he's right in here. Oh, okay. Can I see him from in here, maybe, or from out here? Ah, oh, I see him already. He's, uh... What the fuck is he doing? Is he worshipping those people? It's kind of weird. Okay, we have to stay out of combat as usual. We have to be stealthy, sneaky. We have to be careful of those guys on the roof. There is one guy on the roof there and one guy on the roof there. So both of those are scary. Why do you not climb up here? Come on. Um, are there any more guys on the roofs? Um, I can't see any, but that doesn't necessarily mean there aren't any. Can I shoot him from here? Can I, like, headshot him or something? Is he dan- oh. He's just dancing, having a fun time. Can I just one-shot him? Like, headshot him from here? I could. Okay, that was easy. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I have to run. Run, 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 run. Why do I even bother running? Maybe I can just kill these guys. It's probably faster, right? Yeah, let's just kill them. These innocent people who are just doing their job. But I'm just doing my job as well. My job of being a menace. There we go. One more guy looking for me. Uh, okay, so the last contract... Okay, it's probably the same... The same pigeon place. Or whatever it's called. Alright, let's see what this contract is all about. A botched escape. Some murderous, uh, murderous criminals have escaped from the fort and are hoping to flee from Havana at the first opportunity. Find and kill them. Okay. Kill them, so there's just... There's one more than one then. That's interesting. Where are they? Uh, right there. Oh, that's... Is that where the pirates were before that I said I wouldn't bother with? Or was that further south? I can't remember. That's a very small area too. Hmm. So I have to stay out of combat on this one as well, I guess. Or maybe this is different if there are more than one target. Or if there's more than one target. The, um, the mission description from that sounded like there were more than one. So, wait, pirates? Oh. Yeah, why not? Let's help him. Oh, what did you... He attacked me before I was even in combat. Captain Kenway, just in time. I nice. see you back aboard. Wait, does that mean I failed my my contract? Because I was in combat? It might be. That's weird. Is this a small circle and it's not here? My target. Um. So only four guys over here. Wait, oh, he's in the bushes. That one. Didn't... Oh, there we go. Now he's golden. Maybe I don't have to stay out of combat in this one. I'm just blind. Hmm. Well, I can just jump at him from up here, I guess. There we go, this is the last assassin contract. Botched escape. Side activities, save pirates. 
without being detected. Hmm. Um, you know what? Maybe... Maybe this one didn't have to be stealthy. Uh, let me just check that. Yeah, so the botched escape is 100% synced, so I didn't have to be out of combat in that one. That's, um... Uh, convenient. Right, I have to be... Yeah, this just... Since I haven't played for long, let's just go and do the main mission called Claiming What's Due. Why not? Alright, to, um... Celebrate that we did the um, or finished off all of the collectibles and mana. Let's do another main mission God sink me for this pittance 1,000 reals for those maps. That's what a hundred pound at most How's a man supposed to become rich in these times with a miser like Torres running the world? Have you ever um, You ever worked on a plantation before? You know what I'm thinking? I'd like to see this observatory the governor is going on about. He said it were like a device that could follow people around and show where they were. <laughs> a ludicrous idea. Imagine my wife with such an advantage over me. And imagine what a thing like that would be worth. Sell that to the right person and I'd be the richest pirate privateer in the West Indies. I'll catch you up on it. As a sage in that house, I must speak to, in private. Right, so this is the mission I'm thinking about. Instead of combat and kill guards from stalking zones. Yeah, this mission isn't very easy, but I will do my best to stay out of combat on this one. Even though there are a lot of people around here, as you can see. But the killing people from stalking zones is at least easy enough. Can you go over here, Mr. Dude, sir? Sir Dude? So that's one. I'm gonna kill way more than just three from stocking zones, that's for sure. I think stocking zones uh, include both these bushes or plants or whatever, even though this is not very stealthy, you can easily see me through the grass here. Um, and also, like, those cabinets that you hide in, I think, and uh, haystacks and stuff like that. So all of those count as stocking zones, I think. Um, but this was the mission I was thinking about earlier. Okay, so there are two dudes coming here. That one stopped over there. And that's an agile dude. Can I get him to come here, maybe? Agile dudes are scary. Come on. Can't you jump the fence or something? There you go. And kill him. Yep. Got him. Okay, so I can easily come over here. I remember this part specifically, this little house here. Because there's a dude there. Um, I don't think he's much of a problem. Can't hear me, can he? Now he can. Come on, cross the little water there. There we go. That was all three that I needed to kill. So, so far, so good. This is probably the easiest part of this mission. But now comes the harder part. As soon as we get closer to our, um, our area that we need to go to. So I need to locate my target. I guess that's the sage I'm supposed to target or locate. There's a dude up there, there's a dude there. Can I get him to come here, maybe? I can. Hey, dude, you go. Yeah, just just come here a little for a little bit. Whistle, oh. When you're in a hiding spot at a corner or in a stalking zone, press B to whistle and attract a nearby enemy. I know, I have done it a lot of times already. Oh, he has the key. Okay. I didn't know I was looking for a key. But I got it anyway. Alright. So we have the key, now we can free the sage. He can't see me from here, can he? No, he's blind. Just wait for him to turn around, there we go. Maybe I can uh, climb up here and kill him. I think he was about here, wasn't he? Let's wait for him to come back. Oh lord, he coming. There we go, he's dead. 
Maybe this isn't too bad after all. Maybe I'm remembering this wrong. Can you see me from here? He cannot. Okay. There's a dude on the back there in the back there as well. Wait for him to turn around. Go. Sneak up on that guy. He's already so close to the bushes that I can just go and kill him. I don't even need to whistle. There we go. Into the bushes. Oh. Okay, so there's a sniper tower that right there. That is scary. Snipers are not very good to see. I think I can whistle that guy over here unless he stops way over there, which he might do. Two dudes going over there, and there's a dude there, and a dude there as well. I didn't know those were there. He turns around though. Yeah, so does he. Maybe I can... Uh, oh, I can get it from the cabinet. I suppose. Gunners. Come on, get into the cabinet. I can't run because they can hear me when I run. So as soon as he turns around, I'll kill him from the cabinet. Or whatever it's supposed to be. Copper cabinet. There we go. I love how he stops and turns around before I kill him. Uh, so the sniper, he can be a problem uh, because he has a very good eyesight. Oh, oh no 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 no. Is he coming here? Might be. It's not too bad actually because I can just trick him into coming here. Do you see me from over here? He does. Alright, let's get him. He's practically running over here. You're very eager to die, aren't you? Now let's see if we can trick your friend into doing the same thing. The sniper will never leave his uh, his spot, I think. Oh, did that guy just spawn <laughs> right there? Okay, so these two dudes need to turn around. That dude needs to be turned around before I can kill this guy. Just walk away. Nothing to see here. Kill him. Here we go. Hmm. Maybe I can climb the... Should probably climb the, um, the wall right there. It's too risky to whistle for any of them. Because if one of them isn't turned around when he comes here, then I'm dead. Don't want to risk that. Too many people are walking around. Is he coming? Oh no. Yeah. Okay, I chanced that and I got him. Yeah, the, sometimes they just check haystacks and stuff like that randomly. They're programmed to do that. Okay, jump into the bush. Into the bush! That was very close for the sniper to see me. I don't think the sniper will ever leave, as I said, so I can't just trick him to come down here and kill him that way. It won't happen, unfortunately. Um, can I just run back here without being spotted? Yes, I can. Very scared of the sniper though, but I think I'm fine. I'm very close to the end here. Are there are no guards over here. Guess not. Okay, let's just run for it. So I stayed out of combat and I killed three guards from stalking zones. Oh. Ammo? Oh, I didn't even get to do that. Okay. Basta ya. What is your true name, Rogue? It's a. Uh... <sighs> Captain Piss Off. Where is this sage? Did you set him free? I had nothing to do with that. Much as I wish I did. Take him to the ports. Send him to Sevilla with the treasure. Awake oh, now! I delivered your treasures, didn't I? You did, yes. But you robbed us of Duncan Wallo. Oh, I guess he knows that I killed him now. Or maybe he just assumes. Alright, we got 100% synchronization in that mission as well. Perfect. <laughs> 
A despicable display. This Tusspot is a ruined man, Caroline. Unfit for life on land, much less at sea. If he goes to the West Indies, it's you who'll suffer. Father! Father! Come, love. Up with you now. That old muckworm! He's wrong about me! I hope it's so. You believe me, don't you? Can you not see me? Standing out there on the deck of a ship that's sliding into port. And there I am, a man of quality. With a thousand doubloons spilling from my pockets. Like drops of rain. I can see it. Wait. Do I have to do something in real life now? No, okay. La cena! Cometela rápido! You hungry? Wait, is that Adivale or whatever his name is? The guy's gonna be my uh, first mate. Nice. He's cool. He's the, the uh, protagonist of Freedom Cry, is it called? Alright, so uh, we are just put into a new mission right away. Kill guards from behind corners, okay. Uh, where are we even? We are right in the middle of the sea. Yeah. Anyway, I think I'm going to end the episode right here and do this in the next episode. So, I really hope you enjoy this episode of... Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag and if you did I would appreciate you leaving a like on this video It will make me very happy and I really hope you will join me in the next episode as we see how we do this And I think this is the ship that we take as our own, but I'm not entirely sure But I hope it is because we do need a ship to do a little more exploring in this game So that being said, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and bye bye for now Yeah.